Hey guys, Zach Man doing a video update on Tron TRX. Uh, looking at the 60 minute chart on TRX uh, Bitcoin, uh, we can kind of see the moving average right here, the 20 day. We're going up above that um, from the 20 day, not quite past. Uh, obviously, we're below the 200 day moving average, but uh, we did hit a little bit of higher high and lower low, but then it kind of dro dropped back down. So now we hit a lower high and a lower low right here. So again, it's kind of uh, holding steady. Uh, like right around 565 or 565 Satoshis is kind of the support right now. If we zoom out and we look at the four hour chart, uh, again, uh, we can kind of see, we'll get rid of some, clean this up a little bit here. There we go. Get rid of that. Pop ups. God, I hate pop ups. I guess that's what you get for not buying subscriptions and stuff. But, uh, you know, like I said, the next resistance is going to be coming up here. Uh, which would be right around 600 satoshi still which we have not yet to break through uh, at least not in a while anyways but uh, we have do have some support down here which hopefully we don't see uh, below 500 that is not positive but uh, again we have some support right around 600 satoshi and right around 650 satoshis or not not support sorry resistance there which we have yet to break but uh if we look at the 24 hour chart it's not looking very positive however the 20 day moving average is or uh, sorry 200 day moving average is moving up to the 20 day moving average so um that is a little bit of a, a sign if it can break through the uh break through the uh 480 satoshis uh then my we shouldn't see it uh hit that support at all actually it should uh cross over and then we'll see another uptrend uh some news uh, not really too much news going on other than uh you know there's rumored i don't like doing rumored news but uh there is rumor that uh tron and Chainlink might be partnering up so that is a uh, very very positive news if that's the case uh, so ethereum has introduced smart uh, contracts smart contracts depend on the underlying blockchain for security uh, as pretty much it's a code um, that is reliable when executing the pre-programmed set of uh, conditions it will be useful in the real world uh, with fluctuating variables if there is a connection uh, but basically uh, what uh, Chainlink is Get over to the website here uh, you can connect to any external api easily connect to smart contracts to the data source and apis they need to function uh, but basically uh, smart contracts provide the ability to execute tamper-proof digital agreements which are considered highly secure and highly reliable in order to maintain a contract or contracts overall reliability the inputs and outputs which the contract relies on also need to be secure Chainlink provides a reliability connection to external data that is provided secure at end to end. So uh, it's a very good secure type of uh, a system that uh, Chainlink is. Um, so it's a tamper proof input and outputs for complex smart contracts on any blockchain. So if uh, Tron does uh, go to this, it should help. Uh, again, uh, obviously Tron's doing a lot of major things and the price really isn't moving whether or not this is going to, you know, make it go all the way up who knows but they are uh, a well-known good uh, thing and then a lot of your uh, businesses might actually consider to be part of tron more because of the secure uh, network for the contracts of the inputs and outputs and all that stuff uh, for security reasons because uh, Chainlink is a, a well-known uh, system for that that provides the secure link so Again, it's going to be an upside whether it's going to you know make Tron go to the moon. Probably not, just because of everything else that Tron has done that hasn't made it go to the moon, which is crazy to think about. Like I said, Tron should be trading at ten twenty five cents. Excuse me, ten to twenty five cents right now with everything that it's done with all the DApps, with all the partnerships that it's doing. It's just crazy. But again, Bitcoin is kind of you know holding everything down. So hopefully that changes soon. But uh, until then, guys, yeah, that's kind of the, what we got for news going on today. So have a great day, and we'll see what happens tomorrow.